Hello investors, my name is Bharat Bhalama, lead financial trainer at Immaculate Trainers. Let us discuss one very important ratio today, which is called price to book value. The price to book value of the stock is derived when we divide the price of the share by the book value per share. So in my previous video, I had discussed about book value per share. Suppose the price of the share is 100 and book value per share is 50. So price to book value will come as 100 divided by 50 as 2. So what does this signify? This signifies that for a net worth of rupee 1, the market is ready to give a premium of rupee 1. So uh, that is the uh, significance of price to book value. But does price to book value is applicable for all the stocks in the same way? No. Price to book value is uh, applicable to the stocks which have got the assets on their side. Say uh, real estate companies which have got land banks, the banks uh, which have got gold uh, on their side or uh, the lands on their side. Uh, or uh, the cement companies where there is a sufficient uh, uh, asset base. So their book value is uh, uh, substantial. So price to book value is on the lower side. But for the companies which are in the uh, say service industry, say IT companies, so they don't have huge land banks. They don't have gold. They have got employees which are not counted as assets. Right. So in that case, price to earnings work better because book value of this company is very low so this price to book value can go utterly high 